Hello, YouTube. This is Mr. Simple Majority, and this, let's, this is Let's Play Last Off. So, let me get started here. First off, I kind of need my countdown clock. There we go. Let's see if I can remember correctly. It is. No. Ah, uh, yeah. There we go. Cool. So, brand new, we'll do Easy Core. I don't know much about this. Uh, I remember playing some time back. Couldn't really get into it. What is this? Uh, one item is missing. Arrowhead. Okay. Well, we don't have an arrowhead. All right. I had a little message from the firewall. We've crashed on this planet, apparently. It's like a cruel cross between Material Energy 4 and, or Hypercubed and Agrarian. Now, I don't know much about Agrarian, so... Well, let's set that there. Uh, okay, I think we'll just leave the rest of that alone. Boom. I put uh, Drive and Spatial I.O. Okay, I don't have a drive. The Sterling generator, it's empty. Hmm. Okay, here we go. Now we're getting somewhere. But, take that. Party zombie meal. <laughs> okay. Food journal. I'll take one of those as well. Put that over there, that over there. I'll probably take five of those. A paper broadsword, a bow, and some arrows. Take that. That there. And the arrows. Then carry that sword with me. And what is this? Engineering diary. Okay. I'm glad I put that on. Let's take a look at our quest book. Questing mode isn't enabled just yet. Uh, we can try to get it active by doing hardcore quest mode. I don't want to do that. That sucks. Haven't eaten any food recently. Be sure to have a torch in your hot bar. I don't know how to eat you. Okay, so on Halloween or Friday the 13th, we must have a torch in our hot bar. Okay. So you see, if I'm talking about temperatures, if I stay near this torch, you'll notice that I'm warm. Now if I walk away, let's go over here, and this temperature drops down real cold. So, step there. Let's see, let's go up. There's got to be some sort of elevator out here we go. So a strange chamber here. It's just now a loud explosion. So this is a pretty cold little world they got here. I don't exactly know what we're supposed to do. Usually, you know, you get a quest, you start on it's like, okay, here's your starting objectives, go do it. I literally have no clue where we're supposed to go. Well, let's go this way. They may all bump into something. Well, 
see anything on the mini map. Oh, wait. There we go. Look over here. I see something. It's like uh, something we crashed in. A little smaller appears. So let's go have a peek. Weird enough, we can't actually access that book. HQM quest to enable it. I'm wondering if we're supposed to type that and actually that way it enables. Oh, hello. move that down. I know my sword is about. I think my sword is about to have it. That does not sound good. It looks like a tornado over there. Crucible furnace. Meteor. That is an awful lot of uh, dark. Oh wow, that is an awful lot going on down there. Yeah, I'm not gonna mess that. Considering I don't even know how to make my arrows fire, that's beyond strange. That should should work kind of automatic, you know. Well, that worked out really good. Food jar. Oh, hello. Uh, 49 uh, times. Oh. Oi. Oi. I, I think I'm supposed to type that HQM quest. I think. I think that's how you start this whole thing up. It makes sense because it says you can. It's not enabled. You gotta type that to make it active. Some weird explosion over there. Can't go any further down. I don't know, let's try it. HQM quest. Questing mode has been activated. So now we should be able to open by for greeting greetings. SL minus two hundred and thirty. I am Robert. I have determined the environment of Earth to be habitability marginal. In accordance with my programming, I have terminated your hypersleep. 
Stand by for historical summary C2120 CE. The resources of Earth are exhausted and climate change has peaked, yet technology still hungers for power. To meet this need, construction begins on the cutting-edge bio-2-clear power plant. C2121 CE, shortly after completion, a devastating earthquake triggers a cascading core failure event. Though the event is ultimately contained, the structural integrity of the world's largest nuclear and biocells manufacturing facility is irreparably compromised. With the aid of NASA's interplanetary technology, most of humanity flees to destinations throughout the solar system. C2123 CE, you are almost aboard the last ship to leave Earth when the facility suffers a global catastrophic structural failure event. Planetary lockdown engages. Per safety regulation senior minus 19, you are placed in suspended hypersleep until the environment of Earth is determined to be habitability, marginal. Standby for environmental sit rep air. 72% poor forward slash 12% lethal forward slash 16% unknown. Resources mineral, 7% viable forward slash 93% oviable. Resources organic, negligible. Life flora, negligible. Life fauna nocturnal, 73% lethal, predatory forward slash 27% unknown. Life fauna diurnal. Negligible. Climate, extreme, violent, tornadic. Threat physical, critical to lethal. Threat psychological, severe to traumatic. Stand by for inspiration forward slash hope I, Robert, am here to guide you. Together, we will gather the necessary materials, and you will single-handedly construct a NASA interplanetary vessel of your very own. You will take to the stars and join the rest of humanity in space, end inspiration forward slash hope. Okay, so there we go. And we'll go here to show quests. You started hoping. Manual cement, we got that, we get energy cells. Back out. There we go, and... So next we need to get the wood. I haven't even found the dungeon yet. So I should have, yes, right there. Oh, what else I got? Got camel packs, water. I don't know what those are for, but okay, we'll hold on to those. Yeah. We have sapling storage. So, we're supposed to use the AE system over here. Push the button. Ah, oh, looky there. Cool. And there's a watering can. Oops. Well, kind of hope it's a good luck here. Uh, 
We'll see how that goes. Uh oh. So I'm assuming by what I just heard, my ultimate goal is to build a rock. So that means we're gonna need to get oxygen. Oxygen collection. We're gonna need uh, compression and so forth. We'll need for fuel production. That's not growing. Let's do this. Oops. Take out the four corners here. Okay. Oh, he Not go as a plan. At least I shoot my bow now. What the heck is going on now? I think I'm dying of hypothermia. I don't know. It's hard to actually tell what just happened there. I mean, oh yeah, hypothermia. Insanity 3, 30 seconds worth of that. This is liquid XP takes here. It's awesome. Um, what the hell is that? Some permanent. It's like I'm stuck in a permanent. Ooh, ice sword. Yes. We can definitely use you. Well, that's not helping. 
So I'm stuck in permanent hypothermia and with permanent insanity. Placement Hossie is on the I thought the temperature is coming up, but it's slow. Mm. Oh my gosh, what's in here? I know it's still more now. So he's there still. There's a skeleton here. Okay, that takes care of him. I don't remember that from when we started. It would appear some portal has opened up. I'm gonna, you know what? In the sake of not losing anything, I'm gonna drop everything. Including the sword and the the bow. I, I just think that it'll be safer that way. Drop the engineering book. Go ahead and carry the HQM. That way, if I die, I don't lose anything. I want to check that out. Uh, ooh, shoot. Okay, he went back underground. I want to see what that's about. It does appear to be a portal of some sort. Like obsidian over here. And we got lava. Perfect. That's gonna heat me up. And sure enough, there's a portal to the underworld right here.
There you go. <laughs> Who goes way to defrost? Don't want to do that again. So, we got a portal to the underworld right here. No way up to it. Well, supposedly it wasn't just there. Well, no, it's not helping at all. And I need to eat. I am defrosting, though. And I, I don't know. So that's the nether. Eat the nether. There's some villages around here. And of course, those dungeons. Well, I think it's more of a stop at tonight. I'm gonna figure out some things. I'll have to get that uh, trees to grow. And uh, start working through these quests. But I think essentially what we're gonna do is eventually build a rocket and we gotta launch off. And that's the end of the game. I don't know. But anyway, Mr. Simple Majority signing off. And uh, see you next time. Have a good day.